make sure that if you're finding out that you're missing something when you take a quiz or when you take a test, talk to a classmate. Find out, hey, I'm trying to do better next time. I don't know how you did, but I got these questions wrong. Do you know where they were covered? And think about where were those things covered? Was it covered in the textbook? Was it covered in the supporting material? Was it covered during class? Or was it something that you had to go out and search for like a project? Or was it something that your classmate learned as a result of going out and searching and finding information on their own. When you are taking notes, take a look at what you're writing. Are you simply copying down everything that's in the textbook or are you hitting the most important things? Are you capturing things in small bite-sized pieces so that when you go back over it, it allows you to think about the total amount of information that has been covered. You can't just simply copy the book. That's not going to help you. You need to be able to create smaller pieces of information in your notes, either in bullet format or even creating diagrams. Maybe your book doesn't come with a diagram, but you need to create your own. How can you create a flow chart of the information if we're talking about processes? How can you make a diagram that shows the hierarchy of information? So let's say there's a one big picture and then there's little pieces that are a attached to that one big picture. And then there's even more smaller pieces attached to those pieces. So take a look at the information. How can you create a diagram, a chart, some kind of flow chart, some kind of infographic to help break up the information into smaller pieces that allows you to think about the information in their smaller pieces and keep in mind the big picture at the same time. Now, different professors will have different expectations for students. No two professors are alike. Some professors are actively engaged and creating active learning spaces, and they want to make sure that you get as much hands-on practice with the material in class so that you have questions. And please do make sure that you're asking questions when you're in those types of classes.